Welcome to my channel. This is Alice and today I basically um, it's a random vlog. I didn't really um, plan to do or record anything but today is Monday and today I received um, a very important email from for me um, so I just decided why not take you to this journey and maybe uh, you will be interested in uh, knowing what's going on. So I just want to start with telling um, I'm a part-time model and I've been modeling for just a little bit over six months right now. Um, I've been very lucky and I got signed with the two agencies. One is located in New York City and the second in, Los uh, in San Diego, California. Um, since I've been with these agencies for only a couple of months, um, I haven't received any jobs yet um, or any castings from them and it actually makes sense and I can do like a, a completely different video to go over how to get started, what to do to get signed with an agency and everything. One of the reasons I haven't been um, getting any jobs yet is first, I've been signed only for a couple of months. Second, I didn't have really like any, like I didn't have any um, good pictures for my portfolio for agencies to uh, put it on their website on my page. So I, um, one of the goals was to make a professional photo shoot um, in the studio so um, I can use these pictures for um, for my agencies. And I actually have done it. I might be able to post some of them here or there um, just so you all can see <laughs> what they look like. But um, in the meantime, I don't want to stop. I don't want to wait for these agencies to get me the jobs. It's not my uh, um, the only agencies I want to be signed. I just want to basically get an experience in the modeling so I can basically uh, do research and get or find any other jobs myself. And that's what I've been doing um, this past um, couple of weeks. I have a whole like a, a long list of agencies in Los Angeles uh, that I was applying to and all, most of them are just talent commercial print agencies. I'm a very petite person and I, I'm basically uh, trying to apply for these talent agencies because they, um, they accept different heights and weights and everything else. Um, and I basically want to be, uh, um, I want to get jobs in commercial and print mostly, um, even though I don't have really experience in acting. Anyways, I've been applying to like this uh, whole long list of agencies um, and past Friday I applied to one of them and this Monday, which is today, I received um, a follow-up email and they said, oh, you have a nice look, so uh, we are having in-person audition this Thursday, do you want to come? And I'm like, of course I want to come because it's a great opportunity to, uh, first of all, uh, finally get an experience um, on in-person audition because before I only had um, online auditions uh, for modeling agencies and they are similar, definitely, it's like pretty much the same but not the same at the same time what i need to do i actually since i i've never done in person for uh in person audition i haven't had a chance to print my portfolio or to print a comp card comp card it's basically a, a piece of paper on the one side it's your close-up look uh, like smiling or just like a fashion straight look <laughs> and on the other side, it's more like for more other pictures where an agency can see you with different emotions or in different poses and stuff. And underneath it's your name and your um, measurements. So I need to do this. I need to print my portfolio and pretty much that's it. On Thursday, I, I'm going to have this interview and I want to show you and share with you how it's going to go. So if you want to see what's going to happen next, please stick around and hopefully I'll be able to share with you. Okay, bye. <laughs> Okay, I 
just got out of this um, audition with the commercial agency and it, it went so fast I couldn't even understand what happened so I literally just came they gave me a script before I checked in I put my name and phone number they gave me a script there were a couple of sentences I went back to the waiting room kind of like prepared and uh, what happened next the guy came in and he took me he put me on a tape I just said my first and last name and something else I don't even remember and I went over this script and they said thanks we'll give you a call back okay that's it hi I am back home sorry for the noise my window is open but I, I need to leave it open anyways you just heard everything what happened during this audition I'm just gonna go into like more details but pretty much I went there and I, I've been there for less than five minutes I'm not kidding so basically I came to this building and this building has um, lots of different offices it's kind of like an office building oh my goodness there are lots of um, commercial agencies there and uh, I had a number office um, like office number for my specific agency I'm going to so I went on the second level I went to this um, office and there was a lady she met me she said I need to put my information down it's kind of like a check-in process while I was uh, filling out this paper I was very slow because I was so nervous I even forgot my phone number <laughs> I'm not kidding um, I heard that there was someone in this um, interview right now. It was a guy and he probably just uh, went over his script because someone was asking him questions about like, okay, so tell me more about your experience. Are you, have you been signed with anyone? Are you signed right now? Um, what's your, are you in the union? they literally ask him like a couple questions so and i thought it's very normal because when i was preparing for this audition i went through a couple of youtube videos from other lady, uh, girls and guys they knew that normally they ask you a couple questions so i there was like next to this um paper uh where i put my uh, first and last name and phone number there was like a, a little pack of um papers with the script so I grabbed one and lady said go over the script prepare but at the same time you don't need to memorize it you can it's fine if you'll forget it's fine if you'll add uh, like your words or sentences we basically just want to know your personality and that's it so just be you and I'm like okay I took this paper I went back to the waiting room I sat down I went through the, this um, script. It was pretty. It it was it was okay. It was a very fun script. There was like four or five sentences about cookies, and it's very related to me. Um, I liked it, um, but at the same time, I was still thinking about the questions they might ask. So, a few minutes later, um, a gentleman came in and he said like he asked me if I need um, more time for preparation if not we can just start and I said yeah let's start because I, I don't know I, I it's not gonna be better if I'll stay here for longer I probably will just get nervous even more so sorry we went in we walked in in the room there was just like a little table up with my clothes down they asked me to put my um, shirt off I was in a little um, like a top shirt and uh, like a blazer and they asked me to take it off just so they can see my like um, my body I did this um, so the lady was sitting in the, at the desk putting some notes down and this gentleman who basically invite me in he was holding just like just a normal iPhone in his hands and she said okay just start with your um, just start with your name your height, union and you can go straight to the script 
and I said okay and I did that I messed up immediately I for some reason I started to put like I started to share more information about myself even though it was supposed to be just my name and height and union so I apologized and we started from the beginning and um, I went over the script during the script this lady was she kind of like she was giggling and uh, maybe it was my uh, the way I read the script maybe it was funny the script was funny but I don't know okay this is weird hopefully she liked it though um, anyways um, after I, I finished she just asked me if um, she said I hear that you have an accent so where are you from and I said where I'm from and we had a little like a conversation that lasted 20 seconds max and I was expecting for more questions to come but she said okay we'll let you know if we're interested you can grab your stuff bye and I was not expecting that I did that like you just do whatever they say it's not like oh actually let me tell me let me tell you more about myself and you just keep going no if they done with you you just done so i grabbed my stuff and i left and uh that's it i've been there for less than five minutes guys i was reading and like watching this youtube videos before and basically uh people were saying that this audition could go for like five minutes and could go up to like 20 30 40 minutes it just depends on uh what they're looking for so and this short period of time could be a good sign or a bad sign basically it's bad if they of course they're looking for someone specific so it means you didn't meet their requirements and they just don't want to waste their time and your time either so they just say bye and you just go and it's totally fine um and it could be a good thing if you actually met all of their requirements and they are interested in you and but they don't have any questions because you just you just write person for them so they will just follow up in the email or like call or something else I just don't know it's just i feel like if they would be interested they would ask something but they didn't ask anything at all <laughs> again i don't know um maybe it's a good thing maybe it's a good thing and i will receive an email soon but who knows uh but at the same time i was going to this audition sorry for that i was going to this audition just to get an experience just to know and find out what it is to be on audition for commercial i am completely satisfied how it went i will definitely keep you posted if i hear anything back and if i don't hear anything back it's also okay and i will still update you um i hope i'm gonna get more auditions later and i will definitely be even more prepared because now i i've had an experience okay so right now, that's it. Uh, please subscribe, thumbs up, and I will see you in the next video. Also, please let me know what you would be interested in to hear from me. Uh, because I'm at the beginning of my journey on YouTube and I'm not really sure what people are or could be interested in. So yeah, I'll be very, very, um, it will be very, very help helpful. Oh my goodness. Okay, that's it. Thank you guys. Mm -hmm.